We've been on the water in Venice for most of the day. And so far, we haven't had any big catches. I'm getting worried. Not time to worry. It's time to catch fish. Got to get it done. Yes, you do. One thing I've learned in my fishing career, if something's not working, it's time to make a change. All right, guys, here's what we're going to do. We're going to take five baits, put them in the bucket. We're going to put the hook bait in the bucket as well. We're going to coil off a ton of line off the reels and free spool with the hook bait in the bucket. Gotcha. When we come by the birds, where the birds are diving, where the tunas are actually busting the surface, we're going to take the bucket, we're going to throw it behind the boat. Jerry's going to hit the throttles, create a big whitewash, and then we're going to pull away from it, all right? So the idea with this kind of fishing is to throw the baits back into the whitewash so they get all confused, and then the tunas come up to eat them. You heard that from some guy at the bar or something? No. All right, maybe last night, but you got to find the local intel. We keep telling you it's a good idea to go hang out at the bar. That's not a good idea to hang out at the you bar. You get good info. OK, so maybe I stole this idea from the guy at the bar last night. But as the saying goes, talent borrows and genius steals. Let's just hope I'm a genius today. All right, well, let's see if this works. There's a bird out to your port, Jer. Yeah, I see him. See him out hovering out there? Yep, I see him. Throwing him? Hold on. Still got him? Yep, I got him. Still good? Yeah, oh, they're hold tight on. down to the water, too. Yep, hold on. You almost there, Jer? Uh, all right, get ready. This is going to be good. Tell him when, Jer. Now! Bro! Go ahead, give it. You're good, you're good, you're good. Come on, pick it up. Oh, I don't know if he's there Pick yet. it up. There he is. Up. Pick it up! It's on. Hey, he's in. All right. Pick it up, Chris. Pick it up, Chris. Come on, double. 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 Double? Yep. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I'm under, I'm under. Um, I, I think mine's a Benita, guys. What do you feel like, Chris? It's a Benita, I think. Benita? Yeah, he's got no weight. Well, Chris may have only caught a bonita, but the good news is the technique works, and we're starting to get bites. Going back. Oh, oh, oh. Fish slap. Fish slap. That was good practice. Let's hope this strategy pays off and we can catch some bigger fish. Hooked up. I got something. There he is. Something, babe. Fish on. I'm over you, Chris. Holy cow. Coming around, Chris. Come over. Come on. Go ahead, go over. At least it's not rough out. <laughs> Who's got what? Both Benitas. Oh, I'm getting killed. Mine's getting crunched. By what? Giant barracudas. Oh, he's getting eat up. Oh, crunch. Oh, man. Barracudas. Oh, you looking at the size of these? They're huge coodas. Ah. That's a big cuda. Look at the shoulders on them. Barracudas are ferocious predators, and they spend no time attacking the fish on the end of my line. <laughs> Unfortunately for my Benita, he was an easy target. Dave, where's the rest of your fish? This is what you call cooted. Ah, can't win the big fish contest like that. I might as well feed the rest of them to him. Man, this stinks. I'm never going to win this bet by catching half-eaten fish. Cooted. If I don't catch something soon, I'm going to...